Welcome back friends. So this mod is so simple. I thought about just making a Facebook post out of it, but I think there's a lot of newbies out there that get intimidated even by something this simple. But I want you to know this is one of those that anybody can do. So stay tuned. Okay, so we're here at the low point drains on the travel trailer, and I like to drain these after every trip, obviously uh, hot, cold, but it's when we're on our way to the dump station or as we're at the dump station, it's kind of a pain for me to reach under here. I have to use both hands to unscrew these. So you can imagine I'm squatting over here, reaching under the travel trailer, trying to undo these things. What does it look like to just put a simple valve on these? And by simple, super simple, all right? Just a nice little ball valve. They actually call these boiler valves. And they're made of brass, nice and heavy, about seven bucks a piece on Amazon. You can also find them at Home Depot. Walmart may even have them. So I know any Ace Hardware or whatever will have them. So let's go ahead and get started. This won't take any time at all. Literally gonna unscrew these and screw these in. But I got one step that's gonna be important. All right, let's go ahead and start by uh, just unscrewing these again. It takes two hands to unscrew them because you can see it's an odd little fitting there. Gotta start by unscrewing the black part and then taking and grabbing the. There's gonna be a water, little water come out of here, that's cool, no worries. There we go. I'll do the other side right quick. All right, so. Um, it's amazing. That's one reason I do my winterization old school. It's amazing how much water stays in the lines. But what I'm gonna do here, before I screw these on, is I'm gonna take a little Teflon tape. And I like using Teflon tape just because, it's, one, it's super simple. And two, it's just added peace of mind. So I'm gonna wrap these threads here with a little Teflon tape. Get them started. Getting this stuff started is always a pain because it's so slick. Um, but once you get it started, a couple of good wraps will do you. That's all you really need. This camera does a good job of focusing in on my face and not the job, so I'll apologize for that. So, obviously, let me rip this little. I have to cut that off. That's tough. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and screw that in here. And you can see obviously it is, uh, it's hanging down a little lower. Let's see, I'm gonna go and face it towards the back because obviously I'm gonna be grabbing this. I'm gonna face it that way so it doesn't squirt towards me. And uh, we'll just get this sucker tightened down. Just like that. And then we'll do the same Oh, excuse me. We'll do the same with the other. Little Teflon tape. There's no tricks to this, guys. There's, you know, I know the, I know, the way I am. Sometimes, even the simplest things, I get a little intimidated by because I've always think to myself, I wonder if there's something that I'm not seeing or is it really that simple? Yes, this is really that simple. This is so easy. And they do make, uh, you, see, you can see I've got two blue ones. Only does it make a difference. I got the red and the blue up here to indicate. But if you want to get fancy, you can match the red. They do make red ones too. Um, there we go. So, close that one up. Close that one up. And there you go. Now, you'll notice they do hang down a little bit lower than the uh, just these old caps did but they're still higher up than my dump hose or my dump valve so I'm good to go I'm not really losing any clearances um, and they're probably still going to be higher than my jack so all is well it's that simple guys um, I hope you enjoyed this video you can find the links for these on Amazon down below um, you can also find them at Home Depot I think Amazon's a little bit cheaper but if you're in a hurry in a pinch you can find them at Home Depot so super simple hope you enjoyed See ya.